Hello and welcome to your in-depth forecast for week commencing the 13th of September for the Sun or the Ascendant. This week sees a quarter moon in the sign of Sagittarius, very much to do with freedom. Mars moves midweek into Libra, technically not at its best, but brilliant for reinforcing our boundaries in relationships. But both Mercury and Venus are in tense squares this week, but perhaps the standout influence is an awesome angle between the Sun and Pluto. Because they're both in Earth signs, this gives us the chance to transform our physical reality. But this is an aspect that can work deep within us too. Please stay with me for more for your zodiac sign. And if you've yet to subscribe to my channel, please click or tap on the bell notification symbol. Or if you would like to subscribe to your free daily horoscope to your device each morning, please click on the link beneath this video. Hello Aries and welcome to your in-depth forecast for week commencing the 13th of September. This is a week when you can achieve so much, but it is going to require the maximum amount of attention to detail. Now that may sound completely okay and doable on paper, but the problem is you could find yourself being a little bit distracted this week. Perhaps it's fripperies around you. Perhaps it's the need to break out of the uh, discipline that you've been showing recently, or it could be a relationship matter that calls for your attention. But if you can really narrow your focus, so much can be achieved. But it is true that your ruler Mars moves into your sector of relating mid-week. Now, if it's necessary for you to be a bit more assertive around one particular tie, this can be an asset, but it could also trick you into being a bit too competitive in terms of what you want. And because Mercury in the same location angles to the planet of power right at the end of this week, some kind of push or pull around a relationship matter is possible. And that's emphasized further still by the fact that Venus, the planet of relating, now in the deep and passionate eighth house, which may be think making you think more about intimacy, well, that's in a discordant angle with strict Saturn. Saturn's in the part of your situation to do with friendship and your future. And if someone doesn't feel or seem as committed or as invested as you, that may be why you want to speak out more volubly. On the other hand, if someone feels that you're getting your way too much, it may be them that's speaking their truth to you in a more open way.